Bien, cette conférence de presse va s'achever là-dessus. Plenty of excitement in the Marseille air. We're at the Stade de Vélodrome this evening. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by the former Arsenal defender Lee Dixon. And we've got Champions League group stage action to look forward to. It's Olympic Marseille facing Hermé Leipzig. Yeah, Derek, thanks. You can't really go on and win tournaments unless you're consistent in the group stages. Very important you don't drop points. Looking forward to this one. Champions League group stage contest commences. And here's how it looks for Marseille. We think 4-3-3, but maybe with a slight difference. Yeah, very narrow look about the team up front and narrow in midfield, so both fullbacks should be getting extra pay this week because a lot's going to be asked of them going forward and defensively. And let's have a look at the starting 11 for Leipzig. Peter Gulacci is the goalkeeper of choice. Tiamue Bakayoko plays with Diego Demme in central midfield. And leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. Might really be able to trouble them here. Now he must favour the cross. And is it going to be Gareth Bale? High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, it's all about timing. You've got to wait for the ball to come down, and he's very, very unlucky. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow. Lee, what do you think we'll see from him? Well, every defender goes into the game not wanting three goals in three games to be the player you're playing against and that's the case today well that is how to play advantage there's been a goal in the Manchester City match let's hear about it from Alan it's a goal for Manchester City it's been scored by Jordi Alba he takes a the goalkeeper relatively untroubled yeah he's, he's not going to let that one in Derek tremendous intuition to win it back 
Well, apologies to Alan McInerney for having to cut him off in that fashion. Just to confirm, Manchester City did score in that game. They now lead by one goal to nil. Must score! A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Stop the supply, you stop the goal. We learned that one at school, Derek. Poor defending here. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. News of a goal in the City game, Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for Manchester City. It's been scored by Isco. He got across his marker and flicked home the header. 15 minutes played, 2-0. Thanks as ever for the update, Alan. Marseille couldn't maintain possession. Walker. And Sigankov has it. See some progress with the ball at his feet. And in the end, he's run out of space. Being pressed hard. And now they have the ball back. Can they get in behind them? Oya Sabal! And he's got and scored to level us again. Well, I just love to look at perfect technique and you won't get any better than this. It's just a dream strike. Brilliant, brilliant effort. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Well, we all saw that equaliser coming, Derek, didn't we? And so did he. So, a level contest. 1-1. On the ball, Richarlison. Just to that. Couldn't keep the ball, Bale. Moving forward effectively. I think everyone knew that was foul play. And the referee left with little choice but to award the free kick. Makes it easy for the keeper. Space afforded him. And the keeper is taking care of the situation. Now Canales. Oyar Sabal. Bernat. Effective challenge. Let's get an update from the Etihad Stadium where a goal has been scored. Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Manchester City. 29 minutes played. Delightful pass. Keeper's contribution, but what next? Bernat. It's a cross towards the near post. Looks promising this. Oya Saba! Well, he had designs on a double, but the goalkeeper wasn't having it. Well, he did better than the first time, the goalkeeper. What a save that is. Elects to go short. Well, they have the ball once more. Well, apologies to Alan McAnally for having to cut him off in that fashion. Just to confirm, Manchester City did. It looked as though he might have been onside, but he was just a fraction off. Oh, I'm not so sure. I'd like to see that again. What a shocking pass, really. Sabal. 
Sigankov. Walker now. Couldn't keep it. I must say, no shortage of space. He has plenty of support. Well, they did have possession of the ball, but all that good work now counts for nothing. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. And the referee has determined that that is a bookable offence. I don't think he can think anything else after that challenge. Read it superbly to take back possession. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. He has been deemed to be offside, not by Moxley. Brilliant, brilliant officiating, that is. Look at that, spot on. It's with Camara. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Teammates could potentially join in. As an attacking player, you rather hope you'll get the decision in your favour, but offside here. Yeah, the defence got that spot on, and so did the linesman. Well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. And that's destined to run all the way through to the keeper. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. Bakayoko. Canales. Deme. Now Walker. Now Canales. Bakayoko. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. And that will mean a caution. Well, definitely a yellow card, Derek. With that, the first half draws to a close. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Well, he stepped up to the plate to get that goal. And this Champions League group stage contest commences. Now he must favour the cross. And is it going to be Gareth Bale? High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, he's all... <laughs> Must score! A truly magnificent start. An early goal of the game, just what they were hoping to... And now they have the ball back. And he's gone and scored to level it again. Looks promising, this. Oya Sabal! Well, he had designs on a double, but the goalkeeper wasn't having it. Well, he did better than the first time, the goalkeeper. Well, they did have possession of the ball, but all that good work now counts for nothing. Now Canales. And that will mean a caution. Well, definitely a yellow card, Derek. 